Hello, my name is Connor and this is Cecilia and welcome to Richmond Park, one of eight royal parks. Just a short journey from central London, you can spend the day in wide open spaces and historic woodlands. Richmond Park is one of the largest parks in Britain with loads of exciting activities and things to explore and do and absolutely incredible views. One of the best spots is Henry's Mound, the highest point in the park. From here, you can enjoy a 12 mile uninterrupted view into the city of London and St. Paul's Cathedral on one side. I can see it. And on the other, the beautiful Thames Valley River Basin. On a day like this, the views are absolutely incredible and awe-inspiring. Situated in the landscape grounds of Pembroke Lodge itself, this is the perfect place to breathe in some fresh air and the blossoming sense of spring, perhaps over a cup of tea. Maybe even some cake. I like your thinking. Nestled away in this grade one listed landscape is also the Isabella Plantation. A 40 acre woodland and ornamental garden bursting with colour and life it's home to some amazing plants, trees and shrubs, including a national collection of azaleas. The plantation is at its best in the spring and the autumn, but also the perfect spot for a joyful summer picnic. Richmond Park is London's largest national nature reserve, being home to some of the country's oldest English oak trees and diverse geology. These ancient witnesses are continuously teaching researchers a thing or two about planet Earth and its continuously ever-changing climates and environments. Now this is an incredible tree, do you not think? It's huge, it must be super old. I've also heard a rumour that this is David Attenborough's favourite tree. No. And it's partly thanks to trees like this that Richmond Park has been designated a site of special scientific interest. So cool. These old ancient trees and their rotting woods support so many different species of insect, including the greater stag beetle, which is the biggest beetle in the UK. And these beetles aren't the only stags. Richmond Park has over 600 free roaming deer. In the autumn, you can hear the males roaring across the park as they start to compete for females. This then escalates into the male's clashing antlers, which is an incredible sight to see, but at a distance. That's right. It's really important to remember these are wild animals, so it's always best to keep 50 metres away from them and never approach them, especially with food. That being said, this park was initially opened by King Charles I in 1637 as a deer park, and they've been here ever since, so it's totally worth going to check them out but just make sure to bring a pair of binoculars. So as you can see, there's so much to explore and there's so much to do here. Come and see it for yourself. Let's go.